know, I think one of the great things about Guernic is kind of our undivided attention and just support for students who um, don't really know what to expect as far as their job field, um, but they know that they want to pursue a career in healthcare and they want to make a difference in the world of medicine. Welcome everyone, welcome Guernic current students, prospective students and our alumni this evening. Thank you guys so much for being here. If you've heard of Employer Speak, this is kind of like Employer Speak 2.0. Bring out all those questions that hopefully you'd like to ask our employers today. Okay, so we're gonna begin. I'll have uh, Terry start us off. What could you possibly tell like your younger self? Like what, what advice would you tell um, a, a future version of you? I would say for me to be more persistent. Um, don't Don't give up that easy you know I, the, the opportunities are endless right so yeah. you you can do a lot more than what you believe and apply for a lot lot of positions that we have that's one of the things i would say make sure that that you're going to enjoy doing that job because you know how they say it's not work if if you like what you do <laughs> and, and elizabeth if you can tell me how do you define success in your workplace? I would say a successful LVN is a supportive LVN. If they're submitting a cover letter, if they're submitting written references, it really does give them an edge. Anything that shows that you have an intention is going to be seen. Do your research is the biggest thing I'd recommend right now. Because the world that we're in right now is very different than the world we were in two years ago. Positions pay you know, $10, $15 more than they than they typically do. Don't walk into this with a negative mindset or an overwhelmed mindset, because this is really just a, an exciting beginning for you. What is one thing you look for in an ideal candidate for your facility? Well, I think for me, somebody that's hungry, right? Like say, I'm willing to start wherever, and this is my goal, or, you know, I really, I uh, like helping everybody and I want to be a team player. I think what they're looking for is that you can acknowledge some of your um, stuff that you're not the greatest at, but they want to see that you acknowledge it and that you want to work on it, that you are taking steps to work on it and that you can have a little humility. Here, how do you define success in your workplace? So you have to be able to communicate well, you have to um, want to learn you know and and it takes a team so so that if you can have a good relationship with your team that is how you can become successful so i'm the career services manager i oversee um career services for uh, for all our campuses these are so the things that I, I love getting employers involved we're here to help our graduates and help our, our alumni find find additional jobs or new jobs and i can't tell you how much i appreciate you guys being on thank you guys